episode, we tamed a dragon. And not just any dragon, but a water dragon. I asked you guys to leave it nicknames in the comment section down below, and you freaking did. It was amazing. We got so many comments. And after reading all of those comments, I decided I am going to name my water dragon Perseus. Look at him. It's freaking adorable. I actually still don't know if it's a guy or a girl. Um, but I feel like Perseus could be boy or girl. Maybe. I don't know. But Perseus is the son of Poseidon, who's the water god. So I feel like that fits really well. Now it's going to take this guy quite a while to grow up into a fully grown dragon before we can ride him. And we also have to get a saddle. I actually think I might have a saddle. And we also have to get a dragon saddle in order to actually ride him, which is pretty challenging. My God, he's so fast, dude. Get back here. But anyway, flying is one thing that I always love to do, which is why I love dragons. And I don't think Perseus quite yet knows how to fly. So today, I am going to try to get myself my own dragon wings. This way, I can actually show Perseus the ropes and teach him how to fly. And yes, this means I will literally be able to fly on my own by myself. It is going to be epic. You guys may be familiar with like Elytra's which is like regular Minecraft stuff, but no! Okay, I'm talking real flappy, wappy, fire, breathing dragon wings that I sew onto my back and allows me to, like, do this. You see the shoulder movement? You see that? That's what I'm going to be doing in-game, and my character is going to just soar through the sky, it's gonna be awesome. So in order to craft these wings, we actually need four pieces of gold, easy peasy. We need blaze powder, which means we have to go to the nether. We have one diamond, which I'm fairly sure we have, but we also need fairy dust. Now I don't know how rare fairy dust is, but I do know that it is an ore. So we're gonna have to go mining a little bit to find that ore. And then we're gonna have to go to the end to get some blaze rod, turn into blaze powder. And it seems like there's actually another portal right there. So, and right there. So things are looking up. I don't think it should be too, too challenging to get these wings but after we do we're gonna be able to literally soar through the sky and it's gonna be epic oh yeah and we already have a whole stack of gold from that uh dragon den that we looted the other day so anyway first things first i say we go to the nether to get the blaze powder and it's a fact that if you guys leave a like right now on this video this very first piece of gravel that i break will be flint so go ahead do it i'll give you three seconds three two one leave a like thank you very much and Oh my god! Wait, it actually worked! Oh my god! Let's go! Yo! I was fully, like, not expecting that to work at all. The power of light! Guys, hang on a minute. We might be onto something here. We might be onto something. I'm gonna have to ask you guys to like things more often. Alright, well anyway, off to the nether we go. Also, very big side note, guys. I'm, I've been working on a mullet. It's not... It's not there yet entirely, but peep it, peep it. What do we think? What do we think? I know it's a little different. I just got out of the shower though, so my hair's like floofy. Oh yeah, what do you guys think of the mullet? Ah, it's coming in, it's, it's getting there. Anyway, we are here for Blaze Powder. So, I, yeah, where are, this is the weirdest nether. Oh, there's another fortress right here, let's go. But these are like the weirdest mushrooms I've ever seen. What the frick is going on here? I feel like this could be a map in Mario Kart. You know the one, like the toad map where there's mushrooms everywhere and you boing boing off them? I feel like that, ow, hey, what? Watch it! Stupid magma cube. That's right, fall in lava. <gasps> Yo, what? There's like eight blo blocks of iron in here. Are you kidding me? Plant fossils? I don't know what that is. A green rune? Sounds cool. Block of gunpowder? An aphid and amber? I, I don't know what this stuff is, but I'll take it! That sounds sick! Let's go! Wait, I'm actually getting so much gunpowder, guys. These are blocks of gunpowder, so you can pretty much time this by nine. 22 times nine is 180, 198, I wanna say, 198 pieces of gunpowder. And I'm getting even more. And you guys know what I can make with gunpowder? That's right, TNT. And what can you do with TNT? You can blow things up, is what I'm getting at here. Um, so if you guys want me to blow something up, definitely not Jack's house or, I wasn't getting at anything like that. I would never. Oh my god! Yo! Yeah, I don't think that zombie pigman liked that I just said I was gonna blow up Jack's house. All right, note to self, do not ever disrespect Jack or, or even consider about even thinking about blowing up his house or else, uh, you know, zombie pigman 
it will shoot you in the face with a machine gun and you die in half a second. So I, yeah, you know what, Jack, your house is safe. It's protected, not by me, but by random zombie pigmen that just for some reason have your back. All right, I'm back for more. What's up, boy? What's up, boy? Oh! Oh! oh, 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 oh. oh die! No! Oh, yes! Wait, did he drop his gun? He dropped his ammo. Okay. Oh my gosh, if there's any more of those guys, I could be in big, big trouble. That dude is insane. Okay, but where are the blazes at? I saw blazes earlier. Where'd they go? Oh, right, here we go. Here's some blazes. Let's go. What's up, boy? Oh, I should really make some shields. Oh, oh no, no. I don't like that. Okay, come here. Die. 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 Stupid blaze. Oh, there we go. We got four blaze. Wait, do I have looting? I do have looting. Okay, that makes sense. What on earth was that? I don't know, but I'm gonna get out of here because this is like the scariest other I've ever been a part of. And bang! The blaze powder has been acquired. Now we just need to find some fairy dust and we should have some insane wings. Morning away, looking for fairy dust. Ooh, I'll take some lapis. Let's go. What is this? Oh, what is this black water, dude? What is that? Oh, there's a blue jack-o'-lantern? Uh, what? Hey, just give me a diamond. Let's go. Wait, what? Uh, what was that? In chat, it just said you didn't see anything. No, I did. I I, I did. I saw a blue pumpkin that gave me a, a, a blue diamond. Thank you very much. Gypsum powder. Yep, I have no idea what this stuff is. Oh, oh, oh my, oh my god. We just found the jackpot. Dude. What is that noise? What just happened? Was that good or bad or what? What was, I don't know. I, was that a booby trap? Is that like diamonds and fairy dust and more diamonds and then I'm gonna die because there was a thing there? What was that? I don't know, but it's gone and I'm scared. I will approach with caution. Hello? Is anybody home? Mommy? Okay, wait. I think... I think we're in the clear. Okay, I, d I don't know what that was. It was very scary though. But boom, there's one diamond. That is the smallest vein of diamonds I've ever seen. And then here I believe is fairy dust. Yes, let's go. Let's go, dude. We actually got a bunch of this. So we can make more wings. Maybe we can even trade them to like other players on the server. And here's what seems to be three more diamonds. Can we get four? No, we can't. All right, I'll take three. But boys, you only need one piece of fairy dust to make wings. And there's a bunch of different kinds of wings. There's bat wings. There's actual fairy wings. There's evil wings, there's slime wings, there's blue butterfly wings, and there's monarch butterfly wings. Oh, and dragon wings. But obviously I'm making the fire wings so they're the absolute coolest. But now that I have all this fairy powder, I can make a couple more wings and maybe trade them to other players on the server for other cool things. So yeah, I might just do that. Anyway, let's head back home and craft us some fire wings. Let's go, dude. Fire wings incoming in three, two, one. Yay! There we freaking go, dude. Fire wings. Perseus, listen, buddy. I know you can't fly yet, but I can because I got these fire wings, boy. He's definitely so jealous. Honestly, maybe I shouldn't have uh, done this because now he's going to be a little bit upset with me. Hey! Hey, oons, 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 oons. You see that? That's a real man's wings right there. Your little puny wings are nothing compared to mine. Wait, actually, wait, I can put them on my shoulder. <gasps> wait, can I fly with him on my shoulder? Oh, oh, yo, yo, nah. Nah, that is too cool. That is too cool. I'm literally flying with Poseidon. What is this? Oh my God. I think this is Seb's base right here. Oh my gosh. Wait, I think that this is like a dragon. I don't know what this is actually. Something with dragons. It's like a dragon forge, I think. And I'm pretty sure that's how you make like super OP armor. Yeah, Seb is, uh, he's grinding actually. I need to catch up to him. Oh, this is like Tinker's construct stuff. And I to totally did not mean to steal that. Okay. Yep, Seb is making some weaponry. I might have to team up with Seb because he seems to really know what he's doing and I have no idea. All I know is I can fly and I have a baby dragon. Who is soon gonna be an adult dragon. If you guys wanna see me raise him into an adult dragon, I'll make that my next commitment. Well, comment down below if that's what you want to see next. But anyway, guys, this is going to be really, really important for, like, adventuring out in this world. Because there's so many mods, there's so many things to see. And it was really annoying, you know, traveling on Albert or by foot to actually go anywhere. How is Albert, by the way? What's up, Albert? He kind of is just chilling. He's literally vibing. He doesn't even need a pet. Like, he's just chilling here. Like, look at him. He's sitting criss crisscross applesauce. Just having the time of his life. Who do you think you are? 
Huh? Get away from Albert. Albert's the, the goat, okay? You can't touch Albert. That's what I thought. But yeah, so now that I can fly, I'll be able to travel literally anywhere that I want in pretty much an instant. And so now, our adventures are gonna be insane. If there's anything specific that you guys wanna see in this series, be sure to go ahead and comment that down below. Anyway, guys, that's gonna be it. Thank you for watching, and I'll catch you in the next one. See you, dudes!